You looking kind of lonely, girl. Would you like someone new to talk to? Oh, yeah. All right. I'm feeling kind of lonely, too, if you don't mind. Can I sit down here beside you? Oh, yeah. All right. If I seem to come on too strong, I hope that you will understand. Because these are thick. What? <laughs> what? What are you doing? I'm singing a song. Sharing the night together. Oh, yeah. What? <laughs> Who are you singing to? That girlfriend of mine. You got a girlfriend? No, but you get me one. With that money you're going to give me. <laughs> You're going to buy a girlfriend. No, but you're going to help me find one, and I don't know. Never mind. Hey, I'll talk to you later, young lady. <laughs> you're a mess. No, I'm not. I, never mind. Well, let's get on with what we sold. We didn't have a great day, but we had a good day. It's okay. Guess what, boys and girls? It's time for the Cap Guy Show, starring the Cap Guy. That's this guy. And me, I'm JT. And we're in Oklahoma. And if you like what you see, hit that thumbs up. Hit that notification bell. And subscribe. We'll get on with the show. <laughs> I guess I better get him a girlfriend. Or I'm going to have to hear Dr. Hook songs a lot. Or other songs. Next thing you know, be singing Barry Manilow. Oh, Mandy. Uh, yeah, there we go. All right. Well, anyway, we had um, nine sales, and we'll get into what we sold. Um, obviously, it won't take as long today because I don't have over 30 items over three days to show you. So uh, we'll get into it. Dum, 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 dum. You're going to have that song in my head all day now. By the way, I'm going to show you first that jacket I did not show you yesterday in the video. I talked about it, and I showed you to you last week when I got it on uh, Saturday at the yard sale. Paid $25 for it. I sold this for $89. This is the jacket. It's kind of a bomber-type jacket. It's not a heavy leather jacket. Could be also considered a windbreaker. But anyway... And then uh, this item, I finally got paid for. I didn't show it yesterday because I hadn't been paid. It was in the numbers. They're forty-two thirty, and they're uh, Lee or uh, Sears brand overalls. And I bought these last summer for five dollars, and I sold them for seventeen seventy-seven plus shipping. And they got a flat rate envelope, but they were pretty stiff because they're actually new without tags. And uh, made thirteen fifty off of them, but they did go in a priority flat rate envelope. When there's a will, there's a way. Maybe that's a new one. No, that's somebody else's. Sales of sales, profits, profits, mine. This is a, a Ben Fine. This is a Dickies Eisenhower jacket. Um, it's used, extra large. It's got the insulated, uh, looks like the old saddle blankets off a horse inside it. And... Uh, but it's a work jacket. It's got a patch and everything. And I paid, uh, it comped out at about, oh, uh, two, three dollars because of the weight of it. Um, what did I comp it? No, I actually had 477 because of the weight. I sold it for 2140 plus shipping and I made 1485 off of it. And that went in a 12 by 12 by eight box. Uh, these I've had for a while. I find a lot of this kind of stuff at the Goodwill bins. And uh, this is a Radica Sudoku and a Solitaire game. Uh, I've had them for a while. I've got a few others of different variances and several of these Sudoku types. And I've had them for a while, so I didn't pay more than 15 cents a piece. So 30 cents invested. Finally sold them to somebody for $34.99 plus shipping. And I'm going to make $29.70 off those. So that was one of the better deals. This I found at uh, the first estate sale of the season after everything opened back up. Uh, I bought a whole bag of old Amway stuff. And she had mirrors and makeup. And I paid $5 for the bag, everything. Well, 
There were three of these, two smaller ones, and one, and they were new in the box. And these are from 1991. And uh, and there was a bigger one which I still have. My daughter absconded one of the one one like this. And um, so I put five dollars into the bag, but the makeup and everything else wasn't any good. It was old and dried up. So uh, this is all I salvaged out of the bag. I gave five dollars for it. And um, this mirror I sold for fifteen nineteen plus shipping, and I made twelve thirty off of it. So I made my money back plus a little bit. And I've still got one more mirror as well. Uh, this is a PC game, Hoyle Puzzle Games. It's got all kinds of uh, uh, different games on it, as you can see. But it is PC, so it's older. Uh, Hoyle's famous for making cards, obviously. Uh, had $0.49 cents invested in it. Sold it for $14.99 with shipping on top. And I made $11.90 off that one. The next one's probably one of the most beautiful things these eyes have ever seen. The eyes of Texas, of course. University of Texas. Longhorns. Hook them horns, baby. Woo! Woo! Okay. Anyway, every viewer of mine needs one of these, and I have a few. Not not enough for every viewer, but um, anyway. It's a straw hat. I bought a bunch of these along with a lot of the brand new reversible caps y'all been seeing. Paid a dollar a piece for these last summer. Guy had bought out a uh, sporting goods store near us. And he had storage units full of it. I spent over $100 on a bunch of hats. Boy, there that goes. Well, at least you guys got to go for a tumble today. I'll tumble for you. I'll tumble for you. I'll tumble for you. I'll tumble for you. All right, we're not doing any uh, uh, Boy George and uh, Culture Club today. Anyway, yeah, we did, I guess. I uh, sold this for uh, seventeen twenty five plus shipping, and that went in a twelve by twelve by eight box, and I made thirteen thirty five off that hat. And again, I have a few more of those. So, any Longhorn fans, I'm I'm prepared for you. These are Coach uh, slippers, flats, I guess you'd say. They're ivory. Seven B is the size. Um, I paid three dollars for these at a storage clean out. A uh, lady that I I dealt with for over a year that uh, deals in cleaning out storage lockers after the people that buy them are done, and uh, I paid three dollars, sold them for thirty four ninety nine plus shipping, and I made twenty seven sixty off those shoes. The next is an Atlanta Hawks jersey, and if you've been watching my channel, I bought a bunch of these last summer, actually last spring, April first, to be exact. And uh, I think I picked up about 20 of them. And uh, I still have a few left. And they're all 4Xs now. I had some 3 and 4Xs. The reversible practice jerseys are all brand new by Reebok. Um, I sold this on a, I ran a, I've got two sales going on, two 15% sales on 500 items each. One of them ends today and the other runs to the end of the month. But I'm just trying to move a lot of the old stock. Um, so I'm willing to take less profit. Uh, sold this for eleven oh four. I had two dollars and fifty cents invested, plus shipping, and I made ten dollars on it. Made a little bit on the shipping. And the last thing I saw was these slim shady shorts, not to be confused with M and M, although that's kind of the connotation there. Um, they're different. I looked them up when I was at the bins. I ended up paying uh, two fifty three for these based on weight. Uh, those did go in a party flat rate envelope, and I did sell them for eight fifty plus shipping, and I made six thirty. So on the day, see if I can not knock the phone over again. Um, nine sales, fourteen eighty four in cost of goods, one fifty eight thirty five in sales, and one twenty six in profit. So anytime you can take fourteen dollars and eighty four cents and turn it into one hundred twenty six dollars. That's a good deal. Sales are sales, profits, profit. So I did a little bit of listing yesterday. I did all the Jordan shirts I picked up uh, Friday and uh, that uh, Jordan jersey, that Tune uh, uh, Space Jam jersey. I was going to keep it. It was my size, but a lot of those jerseys that come from overseas are a little bit smaller than what they advertise. So it was a little snug and I don't like wearing tight stuff. So especially when you're a little bit bigger guy. 
Yeah. Anyway, um, we're going to get out of here, run to the post office. Got a ton of packages to take to the post office. And then uh, head back and get busy again. It's a seven-day-a-week job doing eBay, but you can make money. If you like what you see other than dropping the phone, hit the like button, sub, uh, notification bell, and subscribe. I lost one last night. Who knows? Quit, quit, quit worrying about it. We'll keep on a plug it away, y'all. Hope you learned something today and you saw the diversity in the goods. Mirrors to Dickie's work jackets. And, of course, Longhorn hats. <laughs> y'all have a great day and the Cap Gal talk to you tomorrow. <laughs>